right. Today, we're going to be painting animals. Yeah? yeah? But, oh no! What's happened? We've not got the right colours for the animals. We've just got crazy colours. So, what we're going to do is we're going to paint the animals the wrong colours. Yeah? yeah? Yellow. Mmm. Well, giraffes are yellow, but not that yellow. More yeah. of a brownie colour. So, yes, you could if you wanted. You could paint that yellow and you could paint the cow black and white, but where's the fun in that? Nowhere. Yeah. <laughs> so, let's get to it. Do you want to roll your sleeves up, girls? Yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> yes. <laughs> quite smart. <laughs> I need quite a thick brush. Mine. No, I want so what animals have you got here? I've got a giraffe, I've oh, got a cow, a giraffe. and I've got a dog. Uh, these are just pictures that I, I drew, yeah. just line drawings. And then I've done the lines again in Sharpie. Yeah. So when you go over with paint, it doesn't rub the lines away. Yeah. The paint stinks. The paint stinks, <laughs> does it? Let's have a sniff. <laughs> it's fish! It's fish paints! Yeah, it's a bit fishy. And you can do this with anything. I mean, it's just as long as you get a good line drawing. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. That, I think, should see, be look, for that. See, look, over the eyebrow, you can still see the line. I'm thinking I'm just going to do the flower, like a regular flower, because I want it to I swear sort of stand out and stuff. Oh, there's lots of different coloured flowers, aren't there? Yeah, but I'm still doing a stem green. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, I love a neon cow. That looks yeah. great, that one. A neon it? cow. Good pin, Maya. That's Maya, good. can you remember what type of dog that is? Mm. Remember a da... Dal... Dalmatian. Good. What noise does a Dalmatian make? Meow. No, that's a cat. Woof, woof, that's right. <laughs> and yours goes. Mm. No. My giraffe goes. No. My giraffe goes. Boo. <laughs> Do you know what sound the giraffe makes? No. no. I'll put it in. Ready? Three, two, two one. one. Oh, we did start. That's it. That's so weird. It sounds a bit like a dimple. The funny thing is with a giraffe, yeah. they've already got a weird coloured tongue. They have a bluish tongue. They have blue tongues, giraffes. <laughs> <laughs> That's all of one thing of pink. Good. That's good, spread it around. Love a pink giraffe. That's splendid. Yeah. Don't worry if you go over the edges a little bit. It all adds to the effect of them being paint splodge animals. What colour are you going for next, Maya? Orange. 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 Love a bit of orange. Yeah. She's going in the rainbow, but the orange after the yellow. Good, you're doing such a good job. Yeah, I keep doing my hair. I think I'm done with my splodges. Have you done any splodges? Yep. Yeah. Splodge. Splodge. What colour are you going to do the cow? Pink. Ooh. I'm going to do the giraffe thing. Here's a good tip. When you're mixing some colours, use the back of your brush, use the end of your brush like that then once you've finished it's easier to clean the back of the brush than it is your bristles there we go I haven't got any purple so I thought we'd make some purple does anybody need some purple? oh yeah I might you can take it well purple there you go that's clean I took Second to wipe off. So what are you doing, Tamsin? I'm putting in a, ba um, a black background uh -huh. 
So then it'll make the colours on my giraffe look brighter and it'll make it pop more. That's a good tip. Also, if you've got a dark background, when you have them against your wall, if you, especially if you've got a white wall, your picture kind of gets lost, doesn't it? But if you put a dark background in, then your picture will stand out. Good stuff. So, everybody got a little brush? Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to sign our work, because all famous artists sign their work. You don't have to do your full name. You can either just write one letter, or even a shape, because Famous one, the famous artists don't write their full name. You just, just do a squiggle of a shape of a symbol that means them. And when everybody, when anybody sees that symbol or shape, they go, "Oh, that's that famous artist." Yeah. So think of what letter or shape you're going to put. Tamsin, you're going to have to use a bright colour. Yeah. Because you're going to be painting on black. What are you thinking? What are you going to do, Annalise? And ah. I think I'm just going to do a T. Why did you want pink for your muh? Yeah. You got it? Yeah. Pink. Pink. Can we do it in any corner? Yeah, any corner, any size really, wherever you want. Are you going to put yours? Yeah. Here she goes. Muh! For Maya! Excellent! That's a good muh! Two, two, one. one. Let's have a look. Wowza. Nice. Look good with that background. Yeah. So a pink giraffe. <laughs> Interesting. Right. Pink cow. Pink cow. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. That's where milkshakes must come from. Strawberry milkshakes must come from pink cows. Okay. Let's Maya. have a look. Maya. Rainbow dog. Rainbow dog. Oh, that's so cute. Hold them up, hold them up everyone. So, <laughs> there you go, there are wrong colour animals. Yeah. They're cool, so next time when you paint a picture and you think you've run out of paints, just use any. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. And remember, stay awesome!